My name is Michaela Moody. I'm a class of 2023 graduate. I've attended Crescent Elementary School, Rehoboth Road Middle School, and now currently Spalding High School. Some of the extracurriculars I've been involved in at Spalding have included Key Club, HOSA Club, Beta Club, National Honor Society, and I'm currently the senior class vice president. I'm also involved on Spalding's varsity soccer team. Um, I've been involved in the swim and cross country teams as well. And um, I was awarded the Outstanding Junior Award last year and also UGA's Merit Scholarship. One experience in my educational career that has really impacted me has been my time as a work-based learning student. I work part-time at the Program Challenge Enrichment Center and my role there is just kind of anything the teachers need. I'm there to help do it. Sometimes it's really odd jobs, but I love it. Um, my goal is to become a registered dietitian and my time at PC working with elementary schoolers has just solidified and told me that I want to work in pediatric care when I'm older. I hope to attend the University of Georgia to major in nutrition and food science with the intent of becoming a registered dietitian. To my younger self, I would tell her that anything can be a lesson if you know how to be grateful. Um, my sophomore year, I was playing soccer and I actually shattered my knee, which left me, you know, prematurely ended my season. And that was really hard for me. I'd never spent so long not playing a sport. I was out for about 10 months, had to do surgery, all that. Um, but now when I go to soccer practice after this, you know, we're probably going to have to run, maybe do some sprints. And when I'm having to do those things, I'm just so grateful for my mobility. Even though I don't like doing sprints, I just tell myself, like, I'm thankful for my mobility because it was taken away from me from a short time. I hope that my older self continues to just be grateful for everything that I will hopefully have. I have a lot of career goals, and I know that I'll have an army behind me supporting me. I hope that, you know, I'm just grateful for those people who are going to get me to the places I want to go. Um, one of my life mottos is I just want to be generous with my time, my money, and my love. You know, I just I want to turn that gratitude into how can I pour it back into others, basically. And I hope my 30-year-old self is doing that. <laughs> Something that really helps me strive for my goals uh, actually comes from one of my favorite teachers, Dr. Chris Godat. He's also my, he was my cross-country swim and now soccer coach. So one day in class, he just said in passing, it was something along the lines of, um, be strict with yourself, but gracious towards others. And I think that's a really good motto of just, you know, you got to be strict with yourself and work hard and really push yourself to get where you want to go. So that's what I would say to someone. To my underclassmen, my biggest advice is to get involved. Some of the best decisions I've made were taking those AP classes, joining the clubs, joining my soccer team especially. Um, the lessons I've learned there in my smaller classes and on my team have just shaped me into a better person. They've made me more gracious, more thankful, a better student, and just given me skills that I hope to take with me in my next steps in college.